Hey guys, it's Brandon Miniman from PocketNow.com. In this video, we're going to show you how to run the Android 4.0 emulator so that you can try out Ice Cream Sandwich on your own and see how you like it. Let's get to it. All right, so step one, go to developer.android.com slash SDK. I'll put all these steps in the description so you can follow along. And then you will come to a page that looks like this, basically. And then you want to click on the left, go to Android 4.0 platform. And then the next step would be to click where it says download the SDK starter package. It'll come through as a zip folder. You're going to want to extract the zip folder to, I don't know, a place on your desktop or something like that. And you will get something that looks kind of like this. Um, what we want to focus on here is the SDK manager. So double click on that, click run and all that good stuff. You'll get a screen that looks like this. And what you're going to want to do next is put a little check in the box where it says Android 4.0. You'll have a button down here, mine is grayed out because I've already done this, that says install packages. You click that, it will download, it'll take about to five minutes depending on your connection speed. Then you've got the, the uh, Android 4.0 ready to go in terms of the emulator. So close that after you've downloaded 4.0. And then go into AVD Manager in the original files that you unzipped, presumably to your desktop. Click Run. And this is where you create the emulator. And I've already created an emulator. I'll walk you through the process of creating a new one. So we want to click New. We're going to uh, name it, let's just call it Emulator 2. You want to change the target to Android 4.0. And then there's not that many other options that you want to change. And by the way, it can't be emulator 2. It's telling me it contains invalid characters. So I'm going to put a Z on the end just to be fun. Um, down here, you want to change the resolution. The lower you go, the better performing the emulator will be. I'm sticking with WVGA. But if you want to go higher to the full 720p and you've got the processing power to do it, then go ahead. RAM size, I like to change to 1024. I don't even know if that does anything, but it sounds cool. Then you click Create AVD, and then it takes about five minutes for the Android emulator to actually load. It's very CPU intensive. Uh, let me show you what it looks like after you actually load uh, the emulator. So I'm going to pull up. That's not it. Here it is. Here is the Android emulator. And what we have here are some controls on the right that you can use. So you can use the built-in keyboard. You can use the keyboard on your device. And then we've got the Android buttons here. And in 4.0, uh, to bring up the multitask launcher, you tap and hold on the home button, since you don't get the special virtual keys. And everything else is pretty much the same. You've got the back button, the menu button. You've got a D-pad if you want to move around from home screen to home screen if the swipes aren't working. And you use your mouse to interact with it. So that's how you run Ice Cream Sandwich in the emulator. Hope you enjoy. That's it for now.